Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Well, hello there, my beautiful Pisces. I hope you are doing well today. Thank you for all the beautiful likes, the comments, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations to my channel. It is greatly appreciated and well received, more than you will ever know. So, Pisces, what I need for you to do is I need for you to give me all that fun, loving, exuberant, and beautiful energy that you got. You can do that by clicking that like button, you can comment, you can share, you can subscribe, make sure you click that bell notification, click all so you'll get notified. Sometimes it won't notify you as well, that does happen, so just bookmark the channel, that way you can come back and you can find me very easily. So, with that being said, I am going to slip it down as the holy water, see? Ah... Uh, so good in the neighborhood, my beautiful Pisces. So, you know what time it is. Mm -hmm. Tarot's now in session. The most honorable judge, T. T. Dong, residing. You can all lay down. So, we're going to check in on the energy of that person you're dealing with. Or whatever energy could be approaching you. It could be your own energy for all I know. Mm -hmm. Whatever the case is, we will get it. We will hit it. And we will quit it together like we always do, baby. Yeah, y'all. Yeah. My friend in St. Louis is going to be picking me up from the airport. Yeah, y'all. Yeah. So that was nice of my friend. I tried to give her some cash, but she wouldn't even take it. Yeah, she's like, I don't want your money, honey. I love my little Subi bear. Subi bear. Show me the energy of the person. Oh, top to bottom. Show me the energy of the person, my beautiful. Okay. Show me the energy, top to bottom, I don't know what that was. Show me the energy of the person, my beautiful. Oh my goodness, somebody's really thinking about you, Pisces. This is my most powerful deck that I do own. Okay, I will grab. Mm -hmm. Protection stone for the hat. It's covered, but I might as well just be extra careful. Show me the energy of the person, my Okay, I need a definitely protection shell for that. Protection shells for everybody, I see. Okay. Pisces, somebody's wanting to be one with you here. Somebody's wanting to spark something up. Somebody's thinking about you here. Yep, and here's your person. Here they are. Oh, my beautiful Piscean seashell. There they are. They're like... Oh, look at me, my beautiful Pisces. And you're like, I'm a fish. I'm down here. Oh, my beautiful. Hey, hey, I'm right here. Oh, my seashell. They're not even, they're so focused on the seashell here. They don't even realize that you're like right there. So they're all thinking about you. Pisces, somebody is very fond of you here. And it looks like somebody wants to be one with you here. On a physical level here. All right. Very much so. Beautiful energy, though. Very, 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 um, what would I say? It's like, it's, it's out of this world. It's like, it's like, it's like almost like space. Like you two in space floating around, <sighs> holding each other and just hearing the sound of the, the space and, and just like, and it's just you two becoming one. So Pisces, somebody wants to be one with you here. We've got the Queen of Swords down here on the table. This could be your energy or this person's energy, but whatever the energy is in this particular deck, it's very cold, okay? Very, it's like very, you're very scared to approach the Queen of Swords here. So we're going to find out what this Queen of Swords energy is, if this is your energy or their energy. So can you show me what this Queen of Swords energy is, please? Okay, what's this Queen of Swords energy here? Okay. Okay. Looks like here, Pisces, looks like somebody here, okay, has been illuminated uh, to their feelings here that they have for you here. And it looks like this person's wanting to put in some work here, okay? Even though it seems like your energy comes off... Uh, very cold, very, and this person's very intimidated by your energy here, okay? So maybe this person, I feel like they put you up on a pedestal, and anytime you put somebody up on a pedestal, what do you do? Well, you end up looking up to them, 
right? They're up there, you're down here. That's why it's never good to put anybody on a pedestal. You're always supposed to put somebody right at your right at your energy, not up. You make them meet you where you are, okay? So this person's very much intimidated by you and your energy, but they realize they've got a lot of feelings here. And they want to continue to work on this connection here. Okay, all right, all right. That's good energy. I'm not getting angry and screaming or anything. So I like that. I like it when I don't scream. Sometimes I do like to scream. <laughs> Order of the court, there's no screaming here. Oh my God, why did I even bring the judge with me? I will never know. Okay. So let's talk to the Page of Cups, please, and see why the Page of Cups is here in this person's energy. It's all this. Okay. All right, Pisces. Okay. <clears throat> okay. What's going on here? What's going on here? Looks like this person here, um, there's something here where... Yeah, this is definitely a past person energy. It's like, there's something you guys didn't agree here on, okay? Even though this person's got feelings here, there's something you guys didn't agree in agree upon. And it's like this person is in two minds here about you. So let's see, uh, what did this person not agree upon here with Pisces, please? What did this person not agree about? Let's go top to bottom. I don't know what that was. Top to bottom. What are this? What's what's going on here with these two of swords? Top to bottom, I don't know what that was. Show me what this two of swords is all about. Let's go. Come on. All right. Two of swords. Uh, un momento, por favor. Okay. Okay. You guys got different perspectives here on what makes you happy here, and basically what this has caused. Uh, it's some kind of hurdle, okay, in the relationship, okay. It could even be like, you know, a hurdle or a border, like maybe this person needs to cross the Mexican border. I don't know. Maybe they need to cross the Canadian border, but there's a hurdle here, and it's like you guys didn't, you guys aren't meeting each other on the same wavelength here, which is exactly what I just talked to you about when I was talking about putting somebody up on a pedestal. You look up to them. You're supposed to look somebody eye to eye, not look up at their nose hairs, Okay, so this person's looking up at your nose hair, Spices. <laughs> okay, what was this thing that these two did not agree upon with the sun? What was this hurdle here? What is this hurdle here? What's this hurdle here? Let's show me the hurdle. Come on. What's this hurdle that they did not agree upon here? What's going on here? Okay, sure. person has a hard time listening to their own intuition. Literally. This person has got a hard time listening to their own intuition. And this is the hurdle. So your person's hurt. It's basically like they're causing the problem here. This is not you. This is this person. Which is probably why you're here watching it. Because you already know it's not you. It's them. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, let's go ahead. We'll talk to the Six of Cups here and see what this person's currently thinking about you here. So, what is this person currently thinking about Pisces here under the Six of Cups energy? What's going on here? What is this person thinking about here under the Six of Cups energy, please? What's going on here? Come on. Six of Cups, sure. What is going on here? Well, they're thinking about y'all, right? Six Cups to the Eight Swords, okay? That's like being in a mental prison here. So this person is like, here they are. They're up here, okay? They're a knight here, okay? They're in the gate. The gate's open, but they feel like they're crowded with a bunch of thoughts. Like, you're not good enough. You don't know what you want. You cause too many problems. You don't even know how to listen to your intuition. Okay, so this person's having a, a, an immense amount of, of deep thinking here with the eight swords. They're trapped. They're trapped in their head. You're living in this person's head rent-free. So let's go six cups to eight swords, please. Six cups to eight swords. What six cups to eight swords? Yeah, and this person, here they are. They're burning at the stake. Psst. Oh, these thoughts are too much for 
for me. I can't take it. Oh, God. It's horrible. Yeah. This person's about exhausted. Okay. So, tens are the completion here of this burdensome thinking here. So, let's see where this person goes after these ten wands. So, where is this person going to go here uh, after these ten wands, after this stake burns up? Hopefully, they're not actually burning a stake. That would be bad. <laughs> I like my steak rare. Where are they going here? Yep, I got to cover this up. Where are they going? Yep, somebody here is coming back around. Oh, I wish I had my cat scratching thing. Oh, oh, my back itches. Okay, all right. I got it, guys. I'm good to go. All right. So, it looks like you got somebody here coming back around here. All right, it's the lover's card here. Somebody's missing you. Somebody hasn't seen you here. Okay. All right. We're going to talk to oneness here and see what this is all about here. Okay. What's this oneness energy here? It is the card of the world too. So what's this oneness energy and this person's energy, please? Show me oneness. Oneness. Where are we going here? I'm running out of protection shells. Okay. Hold on. Give me a second. I got this. I got this figured out, Pisces. Okay. Okay. Okay, moving on to calmer waters here. So where are they going with these six swords to oneness, please? Six swords to oneness. Six swords to oneness. Yeah. It's the eight of cups here, Pisces. Oh my goodness, Pisces. Oh, my back is itching so bad. Yeah, moving on to calmer water. So where are they going here? Where are they going here? This is like a cycle. What's going on here? Where are they going here? Towards this. Where are they going with the six swords and eight cups? Where are they going here with the six swords and the eight cups? Where are they going with the six swords and eight cups here? Where are they going? Give me a second. Okay. Oh, look at that. Going after their nine cups, Pisces. Going after what they want here. Literally, what's nine plus one cup? That's ten cups. You got somebody here that's going right towards you here uh, when it comes to love. So, it's beautiful energy here. I like this reading. So, Pisces, I love you so much. Tarot's adjourned.